Let's give another round of applause to our youth and young adults. They've done a wonderful job thus far just reminding us that we all matter to God. You know, and not only that, not only do we all matter to God, but we all have a role in God's ministry. Whether you're praise dancing, playing the drums today, singing in the choir, doing uh, any of the, the speaking roles, we all have a role in God's ministry. You know, our pastor always reminds us all we have to do is be usable and available. And again, God has room for each and every one of us, not just in this house, not just in his house, but uh, out there in the hedges and highways. And we just need to remember our role and our responsibility to the Lord. Uh, at this time, uh, it's time for our tithes and offering. Here at Black Chapel, we have multiple ways to give. You can give online at GiveLify. You can come through any day of the week uh, on, and drop money off in the drop box on the west end of the church, or you can give right here, right now, uh, in service if you're present. At this time, we're going to turn everything over to our ushers. stand please let us pray 
Heavenly Father God, we thank you for this occasion, this day. Father, a day that wasn't promised to any of us. But Father, we thank you that you've allowed us this opportunity to be here. In the precious name of Jesus, will you just bless this offering that was just taken. Bless those, Father, that have given with a cheerful heart, for you love a cheerful giver. You said, give and it shall be given unto you. Press down, shaken together, shall men give into their bosoms. And we have given, Lord God. Those that even had a desire to give this time but had not the funds, may they be able to give next time with a cheerful heart. Father, these and all blessings we do thank you for. In the rich, the powerful, and the matchless name of Jesus, we pray for those that are on our sick and shut in list once again. We pray, Father, for those that are away, Father God, from us at this time. We pray, Father, for those that are spiritually and physically, and Father, those that are mentally, Father, in the need of your service. We pray, Father, that you would touch in the mighty name of Jesus and bless as only you can. These and all blessings we do ask in the rich, the mighty, the powerful, and the matchless name of Jesus. Amen and amen. All things, all things come of thee. program we will have a skit why go with Braylon Edwards, Amari McNeil, Jonathan Moore, and Cordarius Robson. Guys, what are you up to? We are on our way to church to Sunday school. I believe in Jesus and go to church sometimes, but Sunday school takes up too much of my valuable time. So what are you up to, Frank? I was just researching my favorite player, Ronald Acuna Jr. He bats right-handed and throws right-handed. His batting average is 284. He was born in Lagoria, Venezuela on December 18th in 1997, and I use his batting stance when I play baseball. Frank, if you really believe in Jesus, what are his stats? What do you mean? Your cards will probably sell on Facebook for a few dollars. If you just follow Jesus, you will be storing up treasure in heaven. Gee, I never thought of it that way. Care if I join you in Sunday school? Good choice. Let's go. What's up, guys? What are y'all up to? I go to church sometimes. I go to church sometimes, but Sunday school takes up too much of my valuable time. 
I'd rather play 2K all day. <laughs> Here we go again. Let us tell you why. to God. <laughs> Next on the program. <laughs> All right, you matter to God. Amen. How many do you know that you matter to God? If you don't know, you should know. Amen. Whether if you done right or wrong, he, he matters. Next on the program, <laughs> we will have a mind presentation by Will Johnson, and after that, we will have words from our pastor. Amen. 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 I know that it seems sometimes that no matter what you do and no matter how hard you work striving to make things better in your life but for some reason you're not getting nowhere well I want you to turn to the one next to you and tell them you tried your way it didn't work no you put him second and put you first Thought they had your back oh, oh. And every time you turn around It seems you're under attack yeah, yeah, yeah. But turn to your neighbor and say hey. See the devil is alive hey. No, I'm not gonna die hey. It's okay to cry hey. Cause he's by your side hey. You gotta stop that hating hey. I know you don't want to hear it. Hey. Gotta fast and pray and listen to the spirit. Cause I'm trying to tell me something. He's speaking to your heart right I'm now. To tell me something. Just listen to the spirit. Oh, I'm to tell me something. hold up. Listen. Mm -hmm. You lost your job. Hallelujah. Your bills are due. And all the people you helped did not want to help you. I talked to my mother. She said, pray about I talked to my pastor. She said, pray about But I was so blinded by all my disaster. I wish you would just tell your neighbor, tell them for me. See, the devil is a liar. No, you're not gonna die. Hey. It's okay to cry, hey. cause he's by your side. Hey. You gotta stop that hating. Hey. I know you don't wanna hear it. Hey. Gotta fast and pray and listen hey. to the spirit, y'all. He's speaking to your heart right I'm now. To Just listen to the spirit, oh. I was in my own way. 
heaven. I'm here to tell you we're not this face of a major failure. So if you got problems, know that you can't fix it. Just give it to Jesus. Oh, can I get a witness and tell him, say, if the devil is a liar, you gotta listen to the spirit. He's trying to get your attention right now. I'm trying to tell you something. I know you got your own plan, but God's got a better one. No. Oh. I'm trying to tell you Let us give the Lord a round of applause. Let us give our youth a round of applause. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. say it again and again and again and again and again there is indeed a message in one of God's songs God is trying to tell you something We can visually see what the enemy is doing. Visually see what the enemy is doing. But according to scripture, when God speaks to us, he speaks with that quiet, still voice. Meaning that you have to be listening and paying attention. Your mind has to be focused upon the Lord. You have to give thought to what you're listening for and who you're listening to. God is trying to tell you something. And if I have ever in my life fail that I can speak for God this is one of the greatest moments of me feeling that way when I say these words in behalf of God is trying to tell us something and I believe that that's something in which our God is trying to tell us is found in our reference scripture 
this morning. Third John 1 and 4. I have no greater joy than to hear that my children 